Laura, it's been 48 hours since the Japan game. How tough have the last couple of days been? Unbelievably tough, to be honest. Um, there's not a moment go by that I don't replay that moment. Um, and obviously, just talking about it brings up back all the emotions still. It's still really raw. Um, seeing everybody's, you know, everybody out, they're looking at everybody else's face. Uh, when I see families, you know, I just, it just reminds me that, you know, our dream of winning this World Cup and getting to a final and winning it is over. Um, yeah, that's how they've been. It looked like initially you weren't sure the board crossed the line, but can you remember or can you articulate what went through your head when the referee signalled for a goal? Yeah, um, you're right. I, I knew I obviously got contact on the ball and, you know, that, w that was my aim um, to do that. And then I just remember, you know, Steph clearing it off the line and kind of everyone regrouping. And, and I think maybe if it hadn't have been for goal line technology, you know, maybe I think I heard someone shout, you know, great clearance, which made me think that, you know, it wasn't a goal. Um, but like, like you say, obviously because of the ref watch vibrating and, you know, it was a goal. Just, I, I was just, it just hurt so much, you know, just my heart sank and it was just the most horrendous feeling. You know, I'd, I'd do anything to take that moment away. I don't know if you're aware of all the messages you've, rec you've received, if you've digested them all yet, but how nice is that and, and how much of a, a help has that been to you? Yeah, it, 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 I'm lost for words when, you know, I really, if I'm being honest, I would prefer no one to know Laura Bassett's name. You know, I'd prefer everyone to know Mark Sampson and Steph Houghton for lifting that trophy. Uh, I wouldn't want anyone to know my name. Um, but in the circumstances that they do, you know, I, I'm just so thankful that the country really is supporting me and the Lionesses and, and our journey. Um, you know, we came out here to win the World Cup. Unfortunately, that dream's over, but we came out here to inspire a nation, inspire people. And it's just incredible that people have fell in love with these people. And I can honestly say that this is who we are. Everyone's fought their journey and this is who we are as people. We just love putting on the shirt, England shirt, playing for our country and everything that represents us as a, as a small island as England. And, you know, we love doing that time and time again. And the fact that people have fell in love with us, you know, has just been absolutely brilliant. There's a big game against Germany coming up. Um, it's for a bronze medal. How important is that game for you on a personal level and for England as a team? to end this World Cup on a high? We know we've created history along this journey and we've, we've pushed boundaries. We've stepped out of our comfort zone time and time again and that's what we'll be looking to do tomorrow. We know there's still history to be made tomorrow. Um, we've got a clear goal, a clear objective. and we, Like I say, we'll promise and we'll try, we'll go out there and, and try our best like we've done every single time. Finally, Laura, it might be that the Germany game starts its process but and it also might be difficult to to say right now, but how can you move on from, from what's happened? Well, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not going to sugarcoat, I'm not going to lie, it's going to take a very, very long time. Like I said earlier, there's not a moment at the minute where I'm not thinking about it. You know, I look in people's eye and, OK, they're not showing disappointment, but, you know, I just, I just feel it. Um, but I, I think, you know, what we've done before, we have to brush ourselves down and kind of gather yourself together and front it and you know we've shown we've got courage and just have to move on we have to try and push boundaries again we have to step up um, you know if you want to be back, go, being back to be successful that's exactly what you have to do um, and hopefully we'll show that.